as a religion because all they propose is tolerance. Tolerance to all religions. I think I have established, and maybe I've done a poor job of doing it, we are in the middle of spiritual warfare in, where are we at? April 1996. But the point is that I think some of us at least are here because we realize that there's a real problem today in the church. And the question, of course, is what's the problem? And what I'm trying to establish is that long before John Paul II, long before John the 23rd and Paul the 6th, there bare minimum were some shady dealings going on. Because unless you can explain it to me, I don't understand why Pope Pius XII is having, and this is just one book, nearly monthly meetings with, Amer with members of American Freemasonry, high-ranking members of American Freemasonry. Now today, in the chapel, there were women with something on their heads. There was a holy priest and there was a holy mass. There was singing, respectful. There was an aura of reverence and there was a blessed sacrament. That's what the Catholic Church is. But to people who are on the outside looking in, this is not what they see. They're watching leadership, leadership of the Catholic Church, meet with members of the Communist Party, like Togliata in Italy. And they're asking themselves, how can this be? I think we're in the last days. How we got here is anybody's guess, I suppose. But because of the way I study, I think birds of a feather flock together. Those who hate evil, I don't think support it. And those who understand false religions, I don't think hang around with members of the occult. The Lord says, let those who love the Lord hate evil. He says, Psalm 94:16, who will rise up for me against the wicked? Who will take a stand for me against evildoers? In Ephesians 6, 8, he says, The Lord will reward everyone for whatever good he does. My parting words to you tonight are, as is said in 2 Thessalonians 2, 14, Hold the traditions which you have learned. Hate evil. Take a stand. Reprove the works of darkness. Do good. And wait on the Lord. Amen.